I know you're gonna dig this. Hi, this is what happened, but you weren't here, so you missed it. Where have you been, Beesh? Bad place. No. Honey, I'm so glad you're home. Me too. Kiss me, hug me, and love me. Do I taste good? Very no, healthy. no. The uh, the pound cake is what you're savoring there. That can't be good for you. I'm sure it's not. So d d d d d d d don't look. I have to. No, don't. Oh, they're not say. going to tell you. Doesn't say. <laughs> of course they're not. It's so bad for you. Well, look who it is. Hi, Gopher Hunter. He's like. Me is to gopher like you is to Bigfoot. <laughs> I've never bagged a Bigfoot. No. Oh. I'm like, hi Kristen. Oh, everybody loves daddy. It's a big daddy love fest. Hi. I just want to pee somewhere. <laughs> oh. Hi. Guess what you have to do today, daddy? Come on. You have to change the router finally. Because mm. it keeps crapping out every 10 minutes. Really? Yeah. It's been a bad day, internet wise. Whoa, look at him. He's still got enough energy to jump up on the sofa. Yay, Chi Chi. He, he's getting really bad eyesight, though. He walked into the ottoman before when he came in. And Sean is listening to Alice in Wonderland. <laughs> Now this is funny. The version that he's listening to, Alice, is being played by Deb from Napoleon Dynamite movie. <laughs> it's pretty funny. Hi. 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 <laughs> They're like, um, why aren't you feeding us yet? Because, Gaston, I have to tell everybody what we're making for dinner tonight. <laughs> Riddell says, get out. Homer's up on his pedestal. Uh-oh, meeting of the minds. Who's going to win? He says, I'm mocking you. <laughs> He's mocking you. All right. <laughs> Are you hungry? He says, we're not talking about it. He says, I think you know. So, tonight I'm bored. So I'm going to make something different. First of all, I'm going to make um, a Greek pasta semi-toss. <laughs> a semi-Greek pasta toss. Some brown rice pasta, some peas and butter sauce, some feta cheese, very little, some tomato, and a uh, purple onion. Spanish onion, I guess. Is that what they call that? Okay, so that's going to be one thing. Then the other thing to go with it, to accompany, to marry, is going to be a Greek chicken souvlaki wrap, but vegetarian. So it's, well, everything's going to be vegetarian. I'm going to take some pesto and some sour cream, and I'm going to mix it together along with some feta. So I'm going to put that together as a sauce. Because I don't have time to make a, um, a tzatziki. So that's going to be the sauce. Then I'm going to take a wrap and I'm going to uh, fill it up with fresh spinach. I'm going to wilt it slightly in the microwave. And microwave cooking is okay. It's actually better for some vegetables than it is uh, stove cooking. Because it kills less of the nutrients because the cooking time is shorter. That's what I read online. Uh, also, after it comes out of the microwave, it's going to have some cut up tomato. I'm going to put the sauce on it. And I'm going to use some Guardian fake chicken strips. So it's going to be like a vegetarian chicken souvlaki. So let's get started. I got my water on for the pasta. I'm going to get that one together first. And then since the wraps are like customizable, they're definitely last minute. And of course, some, you know, salad and cukes and all that, so. All right, dinner's almost prepared. I have the uh, Greek modified pasta toss over here. Mark has already tasted this. What do you think, honey? It's good. Excellent. I haven't tasted it yet, but it looks and smells amazing. 
Anything with raw onion, like, wafting up into my nostrils is a hey, okay well, You should mow the lawn then, because you'd love that. <laughs> yeah, I'm sure there's plenty of fresh onion out there. Mm -hmm. By the way, I did buy onion seeds for scallions, so... Oh, really? Would you plant those for me, please? Maybe. All right, so, hence the wraps. We're using these burrito wraps, flour tortillas. Here's one loaded up with spinach that's already been wilted in the microwave for about 40 seconds. And here's, you know, before. You just want to take the volume out of it a little bit. But you still want it to have all the nutrients and everything in there. So it's just to take the volume out. So here's our Gardein chicken strips. Um, I just heated these up in the microwave for about four minutes for the whole bag. So let's see. How many strips do you think we should put in each wrap? About four? Sure. Four and a half? Yeah. Like that? That's fine. Okay. Then, oh, over here, a little cherry tomatoes uh -huh. cut up. Uh, actually, these are Zimas, so yes. these are a little bit sweeter I than thought they uh, were Zimas. Yes. Love me the Zimas. And then the poor man's tzatziki sauce. This is how it turned out. This is a little bit of pesto with some uh, low fat sour cream and um, feta cheese crumbled up in there. So we're just going to put that over the top, not too much, but just enough to make you realize that you're eating a Greek wrap. <laughs> <laughs> so this is the way I like to roll it. One third of the way. So this is how you roll? This is how I roll. I should have done this on 420. I push this down and pull it like this so that all of the stuff gets pushed over here so that it's like a mound. Then once you have that, you can roll it nice and tight like this, and it should stay put together pretty well. Mm -hmm. And then, of course, for presentation's sake, cut on the diagonal. Always on the diagonal. Always. Look at how beautiful mm. that is. Oh, my goodness. Then we're going to serve it up with a little bit of the um, modified Greek pasta toss. How amazing is that? Looks delicious. Put a little cucumber flour over there. With what? Yeah. <laughs> Alright, so Mark's gonna give this a taste. You actually don't need the fork because you're just gonna taste the wrap. Right. Alright, tell me what you think of that, sir. Mm. Good? Mm -hmm. Alright, well then you enjoy, sir. Thank you. Hey guys, it's dessert time. Was that a delicious dinner or what? Kristen said, yeah, that was really good. <laughs> I it's actually... elaborated, but it's okay. What? Chris, we this is what Kristen my said. enthusiastic nodding as... Yeah, that was really good. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, Kristen said, oh, if only we could have a cafe, Nespresso. <laughs> How about that so Penelope Cruz commercial. commercial with her uh, her pool boy making her a Nespresso? <laughs> is that supposed to be Javier Bardem? Because it is totally not. Where'd that guy come from? He looks a lot like her husband, but it's not him. He's just a, is he just there for the Nespresso? <laughs> it's it's really funny. You had to be there. Anyway. <sighs> You know what tomorrow is. Do you know what tomorrow is? Tuesday? It's shopping trip Tuesday. I love that. I love it. <laughs> All right. So I have to say, guys, I'm so freaking happy with this bowl. This is probably one of the best things I ever bought for my kitchen. I use it for everything. I love it. <laughs> I really do. It is so convenient it looks great and you know what if something looks good you're gonna use it you're not gonna want to like put it away so I use this all the time and tonight I'm having some beautiful strawberries oh I have I had to clean out the refrigerator I have to like eat up all my produce and everything because I gotta get fresh stuff tomorrow which I'm so excited for because I really love eating raw I think it's really working it's making me feel like I have so much energy and I, I think it's the right thing for me to just eat raw during the day and then at night have my cooked meal 
and I'm freaking happy as a pig in Nethretho. <laughs> so I've got some um, chopped pecans on the top, and uh, that's going to be dessert for tonight. And I'm excited for shopping tomorrow. What's up? Verdell's like, what is going on over here? Did someone say Nethretho? <laughs> yeah. He's, uh, he's always looking for food. Whenever he hears a drawer open, he's ready to eat. Uh-oh, he's got to go out. All right, so before he pees on the floor, I'm going to let him go out, and I will see you guys tomorrow. Target time. Till then, much love. Hey,